everyone, this is an unexpected video, okay? Expected but unexpected. Uh, today, not too long ago, they knocked on my door and I got my delivery of the um, Anastasia, the Anastasia Stick Foundation, okay? There we go. And um, I got mine in the colors, oops, they're dusty. I got mine in the colors um, amber and tan. And this is what they look like. Okay. This is amber. This is tan. And I'm on my way to work. And so I thought I would just do a quick video on the foundations of very first impressions. Okay. This is what it looks like. You know. A nice cylinder. And this right here is uh, amber, I believe. No, this is tan. And this is uh, amber. Oh, okay. This is amber. So we have amber and tan. There we go. Okay. And this is what they look like. This is what amber looks like. And this is what um, tan looks like. Oh, they're pretty. Okay. They're kind of similar to each other. Maybe a shade or two uh, difference here. Okay. And let's just swatch it. Let me get you a close up. We're going to go in closer. And let's just swatch this. This is amber right here. Okay. And we're going to, um, there we go. We're going to swatch this amber on my, um, that's an all right color match. Now this is tan. I haven't even color matched them yet. That's just how soon I got them. That's tan. Okay. And we're going to swatch that. Okay. So tan is a little lighter and amber seems to be just perfect. Okay. So what I'm going to do is, oh yeah, go all over my face. We're going to back up a little bit. I don't want to back up too much because I want you to see this. That's why I got this HD camera. And we're going to spread this. Now, I have watched other videos of this. Plenty of videos. Oh, this is nice and creamy. Just like they say. And one thing I know is not full coverage. Okay, that's fine. I give it a medium coverage, a light to medium coverage. Okay, and we're going to go over it with um, a brush here. Okay, we're going to go over it here with my... Uh, gunmetal collection from Morphe okay and we're gonna go over it and you're gonna see right here so you can pretty much get a overall judgment here as to now remember this is the color amber and it's just blending into my skin real good that I cannot see <laughs> so I'm pleased with the color match and I did not get matched. I ordered it online and I ordered it from watching the YouTube YouTubers and decided Amber would be the closest match for me. I ordered tan just in case Amber was too dark. That's all that was. Okay. So I ordered tan in case Amber did not work out but it's working out perfect okay wow I'm liking the finish I really am okay now you see the medium coverage okay you can still see my spots okay but what I'm liking about it is because the color match is so good see look at that can you even see what I'm <laughs> it's like I'm doing nothing but anyway the color match is so good 
I am not going to go in for a full coverage, okay? I like it just the way it is, nice and natural. Okay? I'm even going to go in with a little tan just because around this spot just to add something to it, okay? So that's how tan looks. And I'm going to go in just lightly with this tan. And it's just disappearing. So that's what I'm liking and that's what I'm hoping for. It just melts into this other color. Wow. Okay. Hopefully you're watching this in HD. Okay. Amber and tan. Okay. I'll be back with the rest of my look. Okay, I'm back with the finished look. As usual, getting ready to go to work. And um, I sprayed it with this um, this setting spray, the Urban Decay setting spray. Okay, and that might be why you see a glow all over my face too, okay. Because that's this, this setting spray, okay. Uh, it does that. But anyway, I like it though. So... I am so satisfied with the overall finish. It does look very natural, okay? And two is that even though it's uh, a medium coverage, okay, as you can see there, it still looks natural, though. And, and so, yeah, I like it. I really do. And for 25 bucks a stick, okay? And, um, yeah, so I may even try that tan out, too, okay? So let me get you in closer. Oops, move back there and we can see, you can see, uh, how this looks on my skin. Ooh. Okay, I think it looks really nice. It makes my skin look nice. I think it looks a lot more natural. Mm -hmm. And um, we'll see. We'll see. Okay. So I'll be back after uh, eight hours. Yeah. I work seven and a half hours. But the time to get there and the time to come home and all that. So eight hours. So I will be back about 10.30 tonight, because right now it is 1.34, okay, and we will see, okay, the end results, because that's how I go by a foundation, is if it can last all the way through work. Now, if I have to do a, a blot, that's cool, but usually I'm not into going back and forth and blotting, so we'll check this out, okay? So see you then. Okay, everyone, I'm back from work, and uh, it is 10.52, almost 11 o'clock, and uh, I, ran to Walmart. I ran to Walmart, okay, right after work, so it's a little later. Yeah, I have 10.54 right here, okay, and overall, it held up pretty good, wouldn't you say? Okay, now, I know I look a little shiny, okay? Number one, I got the light on. And uh, number two is this spray, this uh, Urban Decay Setting Spray, okay? It works good, and I like how it held up, but it does leave a sheen, 
over your face okay so you have a glow like uh like you did highlighter okay all over your face so but not real bad you know nice healthy glow and i noticed so that is my what uh makes it look a little extra so when i zoom in keep in mind i do have that spray on now i have not blotted all day i was gonna blot but i said you know what i've been blotting okay more than normal because i usually don't blot once i put my makeup on i go to work and i'm done and i just try to uh make sure that my uh eyeshadow okay hopefully stays in place because some of these eyeshadows and i'm gonna do a video on that some of these palettes even these pricey ones okay are not all that especially when my makeup does my eyeshadow doesn't last but okay on top of that it's all blended together like one it doesn't look like i did anything but anyway that's another subject so uh i like the setting spray you know and um I like the uh, way that this uh, foundation comes out. Now, like I said, it's not full coverage. Even though it says full coverage, I think it says full coverage or something or buildable. Maybe it's buildable, but I don't want to build it. I like it just like it is, okay? It's nice and light, okay, or medium. It's medium. For me, it's medium. And that is, I have on some makeup, but I can see my blemishes or dark spots come through but it doesn't look so bad so let's zoom in okay you see how that held up let me see I don't see it breaking up now I would say you see how I smile okay and my lines in here I don't see any lines or do you mm -mm -mm. I don't really see anything that really looks like a, a, a real breakup to me let me check out the nose part here okay uh no uh uh no it just looks like um i've been outside in this in the heat you know that's about it so i'm 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 liking the outcome of this anastasia Beverly Hills uh, stick foundation and is it worth the money hell yeah it's worth the money it only cost $25 held up all day okay even uh, even though I put a setting spray on there okay it still held up under the setting spray and it pretty much looks like um, sheesh like I just put it on you know so I'm, I'm, I'm liking that. I give it a thumbs up. I definitely give it a thumbs up. So if you're able to go out there and get this product, okay, I suggest, yeah, I suggest that you uh, get this product. Now, if you're looking for full coverage, then this may not be the product for you, okay? But I have, uh, let me see, I wouldn't say dry, I have dry skin, more to dry. In the summer, it can be oily from the heat, sweaty, okay? I like to call it sweaty. But uh, in the uh, winter, it's dry. So you can do your own calculations from that. But nevertheless, okay, sub me. I'll sub you back. Leave your comments down below. If you like this look, if you like how this uh, foundation held up, give it a thumbs up. And most of all, stay blessed. Bye.